You create an editor window. It looks very pretty, but you start to add extra buttons for functionality that's not really used that often, but you do need on the window. Well, let's banish these buttons and stick them up into the tab menu, but an interface so secret, well, it's not secret, it can be found in the API docs, but it's not really referenced anywhere. So let me introduce you to it. Okay, so it's not secret as this one, unlike a lot of my other videos, can be found in the docs. But as usual, it's not really mentioned anywhere. Good job, Unity documentation. So without further ado, let's stick one more snippet into that Unity toolset that's cramping our brains to capacity. We have here the most amazing editor window that's ever existed. It mass assigns script icons. Okay, it's not that amazing, but it makes me happy. And I will leave a link in the description from another video on how to make it. Anyway, when I was making this editor window, I realized a slight outside case of what happens when I add an icon after the window has been done caching its icons. Now I could perform a refresh whenever I let that window take focus, but that seemed a little overkill for this really very, very rare case. I don't wanna be refreshing it every time I bounce back and forth. So I chose to add a button, a refresh button, but now my window looks a little bit messy, a little bit cluttered, and everybody knows I hate cluttered windows. So there is another option, and I can banish this button to the free dot menu ellipse icon drop down button that goes alongside the tab. To do that, we jump into the code, and all we need to do is add the interface has custom menu. And if we implement that interface, we get a method called add items to menu. And that's really it. We can jump into that method. We can add our refresh call, deleting the button as we go, and we're ready to jump back into Unity. Now, as we can see, the refresh button is gone. And now pressing on the tab menu, we have the refresh option ready to go. And that's all we need to do. This is just a quick tip for a nice way of minimizing the clutter on your windows from me to you.